All right, happy Monday, kindergartners. Today for the Blue Reader, we have Go and Play. So I want you to realize or to recognize that go and play are all popcorn words. So I hope you are reviewing your popcorn words. I'm gonna try and send you some activities to work on those over spring break. Go and Play by Katherine Scraper, illustrated by Elise Mills. So Katherine Scraper wrote the story and Elise Mills is the person responsible for the illustrations. So um, a baby bear is called a cub. So I'm just giving you that vocabulary word. And these are ducks. Now, remember our special sound cards, k as in duck? So at the end of a word with a short vowel, you often have a CK that says k. So that's the case of the word duck. It's D, D, A, uh, U, and then CK, a uh, uh, umbrella. All right, let's get started. All right, see the birds here? It says, see what birds do, you can too. Go and play, cub. So the word see, what, do, you, can, go, and play are all popcorn words. See what ducks do, you can too. Go and play, cub. Now the reason the C is capitalized in this word is because it is the name. We are calling him Cub, just like we call Adele Adele. We're using that as his name. So names are capitalized. See what rabbits do? You can too. Go and play, Cub. Do you remember? I don't know. I think I filmed the video about the bear snores on. If you haven't watched that video yet, um, we talk about another name for a rabbit in that video, and that is a hare, H-A-R-E. It's still it's spelled differently than the hair on your head. But these are rabbits. They start with an R, and we can use the context of the pictures to figure that out. See what bears do? Go to bed, cub. If you don't know what this word is, you can certainly sound it out. Ba. Eh, duh. Same with cub. K -ub. All right, so enjoy reading that story. Practice it with your parents. The, the more you practice these, the easier reading will be for you.